Guys, today I'll be showing you how to bypass a copper phone. This phone is a Nokia phone, and this passing method is available to all Nokia phones. You only need one comment and show you have lucky pattern. So, guys, don't forget to subscribe, like, and please share. And also leave a comment below there so that I can know what you think about this video. And I'll update you guys on what is happening next. Hello, guys. So let's check on this phone. You can see it is here. Yeah, we have the soft lock. You have to click on it and go to the settings about the app information. So in my device, this app you can disable it or clear the storage or clear the cache data or the app. So this is about the app. So we have to go back and show that display of other apps is not allowed. So modifying system settings is not allowed. Install and on apps is not allowed. So guys, let's now add that to Lucky Patcha. And so you have, that is the Lucky Patcha. You can find it by searching Lucky Patcha on the website on Chrome. Or Opera Mini, you can find it there. So guys, you're going to find the app called Face. So this Face app is like the Android operating system. So this app is connected with the soft lock app. So the first thing you have to do is to clear the data and the storage of this app. So let's go to storage, clear khaki. Then you're gonna add it back and check. Open by default should not be allowed. Then display where other apps should not be allowed. Because this app it is connected to um, copper. It is going to the um, copper soft lock attic. So let's uh, check where the app locks. Because I know you're wondering how comes this app called face connected to the other attic called soft lock. This is an Android phone and all the apps are connected in one way or the other. So and for it to run successfully, it will see the face attic. So we're going to say mobile data. There you will find soft lock. Yeah, there's soft lock. So we have already known the connection between soft lock and face. So guys, there it is now. We have done with that. So let's go now and find the soft lock app. Guys, I can't find my settings. Oh, there. We are gonna search it now because it is, I think it is down there. So we're gonna search soft lock. So let's go soft lock. Let's go soft lock. The app appears. When I go to not tools, I'm sorry guys, let's go back. And I have to go to menu of patches. Then app it with change permissions and activities. We are going to have to disable all of them. As the receive boot completed, this helps in the app where you will restart your phone, the app will at all launch and launch the phone. But with the receive boot completed, disabled, now the other settings disabled, the app will not, will not be able to run. If it tries to launch, it will close itself. Guys, you will find it at the end of this video. So guys, don't worry. We are going to have to disable everything. There we go. These are the necessary permissions. This app is enabled. You will learn this later if you do software engineering and some things like this. Yeah, the app needs these permissions to run. I have disabled all of them. So I made the last one. So I'm going to disable all the permissions. And I'm going to have to tick signature verification killer. So I'm going to the doing its work. Then I'm going to go to the file or browse. Anyone, any can work. Go to file. There. But me, I had already passed the app. So here, yeah, these are my versions. So I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back. Back. Then I'm gonna insert the latest version that I've already passed just now. So you guys can see how it works. So that is soft lock 4.42. Just press install. Yes. Install. I'm still going to put a notification there, then update soft lock. Then it is installing, installing. The phone will definitely lock there and lock itself. So get it installing. There it goes. Just when it locks itself, then it unlocks itself. Guys, we are done. Thank you for watching my video till the end. Please don't forget to subscribe and like and leave a comment what you think about the video. Yes, it's acting. Acting. This video is for education purposes only. Nobody should use it for 
Sonava Badabind.